Hello again, it is I, Chimmerin, and it is time for the next episode of Minecraft Hardcore. Now, before we move on, I want to thank you all very much for watching this series. It means a lot to me getting views on them, and on TikTok, getting feedback as well, and it, it's very fun. I enjoy making videos for you guys, I greatly appreciate all of it. Now, we are getting dangerously close to the end of the series. As I've said, I think I'm not entirely sure my mind isn't in a good place today but we're going to make do with it. But anyway, we're getting dangerously close to the end of the series and there may be time to fight the end dragon. I'm not sure. If I don't fight the end dragon, there may be a one-off episode in the future where I do because I can't just leave this world untouched. But the goal is to have eight episodes and we're nearly at the end. Now, uh, with all of this out of the way, today's plan actually is um, never portal stuff. Going into the nether, like I said last time. But I want to quickly show you guys down here that nothing has changed. I've been busy. I, well, busy in real life, not in Minecraft, so I haven't actually had a chance to um, do the villager trading stuff, which I'll be doing in between episodes. Don't worry, I don't procrastinate. I'm going to work hard because if I'm going to kill the Ender Dragon, I'm going to need upgraded gear. As you can see, let's see if I've found any babies. Have we got any children? I don't see any babies down there, it's a shame. Anyway, uh, I'm going to feed them some bread to kickstart it all. Actually, the best way to do things, if I pop around here, I go down my little, my little thingy my bob. Uh, hello villagers, don't, don't, oh you can escape, that's fine. But have some bread. You thought you could leave? That's right. This is a good time to experiment see if this tube actually works properly. Is he going to arrive? Any second now. I think he's trying to swim. You haven't got any hope, my friend. Oh, I know where I went wrong. One second, this is going to be very risky. There we are. And down he goes. Into the depths. Oh, never mind. This guy. This guy's an absolute chad. Anyway, I guess we'll leave him to it. But, um, yeah, as I've mentioned before, today's episode is about about combat. We're going to fight some blazers and explore a fortress. Now, if that's what you like, you're in for a treat. Because this episode, I may die, and I may have to restart everything. Lose all these 21 levels, or I'll lose everything if I die. Which is unwanted, but uh, I'll meet you at the fortress. See you in a minute. Oh dear. Oh no. Uh, problems? There is a blaze there. I was trying to build a cross. He's just ruined my day. Just slowly, but surely, make my way across. Make sure he doesn't see me. Right, we're in. Oh no. Skeletons, skeddy bros, back off. Back off, this is new territory. Go away. Yes, skeletons. Oh, skeletons, do your thing. some more way to go to this fortress to get in and start a new recording for you guys. And look, look, I'm surrounded. There's nowhere out. This is horrible. I don't like this place. This place is horrible. It never sucks. 
I'm doing this for you guys, if you can't tell. Wait, they do melee damage? Such so blazes attack you with melee damage. That's preposterous, I say. Yep, no, uh, okay. Okay, I got him. Oh, gosh. It's the biggest challenge yet on this entire series. I'm not going to lie. I don't have another. I'm, I'm struggling for words. I'm sorry if my commentary is bad this episode. But I'm just so scared out of my mind. I'm so focused I can't speak and fight at the same time. Come on. He's so out of my comfort. How did he hit me? That doesn't seem right. That doesn't seem fit. What's that? Skull? No. At least I'm getting plenty of cold in my furnaces. Okay. Okay. Well, fear is up. How? How? Alright, I'm on fire. I am a hot and sexy man. This is not going well. Sorry, I'm not speaking much, it's just panic right now. No trapping you there. I, I can't hear their footsteps, I don't know if this is a bug. Or am I I'm just being stupid or not, I don't know. But this is, this is petrifying. I'm honestly petrified. I'm so petrified right now. It's the most emotion I've felt playing Minecraft ever. Help my elder, everything's doing fine. Don't you dare. I kind of want to go home and do some terraforming now, um, I'm not going to lie. It's, it's finally clear over here for me to go to the blaze border. My shield broke. I'm going home. There we go. I'm going. The only thing keeping me alive has gone. My failsafe is gone. I'm so scared. I'm going on. Uh, fancy a, um, a terraforming episode, guys. Um, I, I don't want to do this anymore. I, I think I'm going to go home and do some building. Because that's what I actually enjoy. And I've, I've got four blaze rods. I don't know if that's any use. You can't say I didn't try and there's no loot there whatsoever. It's the worst fortress I've ever visited. Great if you want to farm stuff. Terrible if you're a guy called Jimmerin. Because that just sucks. That is just horrific. The amount of fear that I went through. I'll, I'll see you guys back at, back at home. That was single handedly the worst visit to the Never ever. I am never, ever, ever going back to the Never. That, that was a reference, by the way, if you can't tell, to an old Minecraft parody. I'm in the Minecraft parody mood today. Don't know why, I'm just reliving my childhood. Right, how much blaze powder can we get? Eight blaze powder. That's not bad. I think for an eye of ender, you don't need that much anyway. You need one each. So, I need, I think... Yeah, you need 12 eye of enders at the minimum. So eight isn't actually... That's a lot of progress, actually. I can finish that up in between episodes. Gotta go put that in the chest of awesomeness. These chests are getting changed nicknames every single episode. Oh, that, I've got PTSD. Honestly, that bee noise scared me. Oh, I've got post-traumatic stress disorder from from the never. I haven't even got any iron. I have to go find some iron. <laughs> well, I might just be in line. Please tell me there's something here. There's gold. Brilliant. Who, who uses gold in modern society? Time to do some mining, I guess. My, my mood is strong, I'm exhausted, if you can't tell. Actually, I noticed a, um, a good cave this way I can look into. I was recording a uh, TikTok for advertising purposes. Ooh, I know, I'm clever. And I saw a cave in the background when I was standing on top of the church. You may have saw it if you're a loyal person and watch my TikToks, which you should definitely do, by the way, at Jimmerin TikTok. Just do it. I am known as a king there, so that's awesome. Now this is the cave I was on about. I can already see some iron. I should have done this like episode one. 
I thought, oh, I never knew this was here. Which is weird, considering how big the cave is. But I'm just here for some time. I could go deeper, if I really wanted to. This episode could lead me from exploration and awesomeness. But I think I'm kind of done, done in for the day already. Oh, where did you come from? Have you just been chilling in this hole, or did you just appear out of thin air? As per usual, absolute ripoffs. Oh, cool, I wonder where I got these leads from. Ah, random. Let's get some iron, shall we? Ooh, more iron. Sorry if this episode is a, a, a tad bit boring now that I'm not in the nether. But, you know, everyone says, have the climax at the start, you know? No, no one ever says that. <laughs> I've had enough of lava today. No thank you, good sir. If you guys want the siege to this world, by the way, I'll pl I can put it in the comments if you ask for it. And then you can experience what I experienced for yourself. A nether fortress. That has loads of crossroads in hardcore mode. Not fun. Imagine if I decided to go in there last episode. I was not mentally prepared. I, I wasn't prepared now. Anyway, I'll uh, see you at home. Ah, here we go. Hope sweet home. Time to start smelting. My iron in the furnace. And I'll put some that in there. But before we move on. I just want to say that this episode is sponsored by, yes right, I've got a sponsor. Just kidding, it's sponsored by me. I'm sponsoring myself. Why? Because you guys should definitely go follow my TikTok and Twitter accounts, obviously. Shameless self-promotion time, baby. Woohoo! TikTok is at Chimmerin TikTok. Go follow me there. And Twitter is at Chimmerin YT. I post regular updates on there, whether or not I am on a double upload schedule or not. So go check them out. You'll get to talk to me on a more personal level as well through the comments. Of course, if you comment on this video, I do the same. But it's more um, laid back and more chill, chillier, chiller, chill. It, it, it's it's a more chill environment. Okay, leave me alone. And uh, I'm I'm gonna go on a nice walk. Okay, it's getting dark, but I'm gonna go on a walk. And when my uh, stuff is smelled, finished smelting, I shall return. See you in a second. Here we are. I am returning from my walk. Definitely didn't go to bed or anything. And oh, look at all these bees there. There's too many of them now. The trees keep growing with bees. Oh, this isn't done. It's got enough that I need though. To be honest, all I needed was enough for a shovel and good old, um, good old Mr. Shield to return. Sh oh, okay, cool. Shovel. Where's Mr. Shield gone? Here he is, Mr. Shield. I need one of you. Thank you very much. I can now safely return to the Nether. If I want to. Here's a spoiler. I, d I don't want to go back. But, anyway. Oh, why don't I move my shoulder? Um, I'm going to go gather some resources. And I'm going to do some terraining to make my house look more natural. Because if you look outside, I'm tied back. It looks like it's kind of been plonked here. As nice as it looks, everything doesn't look very natural. So I'm going to change that. So, I'll see you in a second when I got the materials. There we are. You know, that's much better. Although, I'm going to have to do something about that uh, stump there. Anyway, I say it is just about time that we either kick off a building montage, or a time lapse. We'll have to see what editing Chimmerin thinks about that. But anyway, let's get into it. Oh yeah, um, I, I forgot to say what I was doing. Um, terraforming and land training. I'll talk you through it afterwards. Anyway, back to it.
guys, here's to find a product. We've got the bees there, we've got the trees, we've added a lot more greenery around us on walls. Add a little bit of a final, a final touch there. In my opinion, all the greenery and the walls make it seem like this is a lot more lived in. With all the smaller trees growing, the bigger trees, it makes it feel more natural and the, the base itself feels like it should exist here. It feels like it's been here for a long time. We've got our farm, which I still haven't fully seeded yet. I'll be doing that in between episodes. Our portal is a lot more hidden. So it's much of a, as much of an eyesore to the base, which is quite cool. And um, over here, obviously, you've got our mine again. We've got these walls. Make a lot, walls make things look a lot more man-made. And we've got a nice little path that goes around our tree as well. Oh, it's a pig! You the swine. There you go. I also added some more dirt around the house. So basically, what I did was go, oh, this bit looks a bit bare. And then I plopped some dirt around. Basically, it makes it feel like the house is more stable and it hasn't been just plonked on top of land. It makes everything look a lot more smoother in my opinion. We've also got this hedge here. Hedges just help make things look nicer. And yeah, that's basically what I've been done. To calm myself down from the nether issues. Because as we all know, the nether was petrifying. It was, it was horrific. Anyway guys, oh, anyway guys, that's just enough time to wrap up this episode. It may be shorter than usual, I'm not entirely sure. We'll have to see whilst I'm editing. Sorry if it is a little bit shorter than normal. For that, I really am sorry. I'm sorry for the fact I nearly died. It could have been the end of my series. And if this episode was a little bit boring, then please forgive me. Anyway, I want to thank you all very much for watching. This has been a blast. This is Jibrin, and I'll see you next time.